It appears to be an ambitious move, but Chelsea has been linked with a bid for Barcelona goalkeeper Marc-André Ter Stegen. Firmly entrenched at Camp Nou, Ter Stegen will not come cheaply for Chelsea as it goes into the summer transfer window on a mission. Suggestions of signing Ter Stegen also indicate Chelsea's discontent with Kepa Arrizabalaga, back in the team after being dropped by manager Frank Lampard. Various leagues and competitions around Europe are taking various approaches to coping with the spread and threat of coronavirus. While La Liga and Ligue 1 will play games in empty stadia, Serie A has been suspended until at least April 3, with the real possibility of an extended period without football. In fact, it has been suggested the Serie A season might be abandoned without a champion being crowned, or it will decide the title with a top four playoff. There are different options on the table, and every party involved will make their own considerations, and the next federal meeting will be guided by a principle that is yet to be adopted. Two of this week's four Champions League games were played behind closed doors, while the Europa League games involving Inter Milan in Hetafe and Roma and Sevilla were postponed. Wanted by Inter Milan last summer, it appears Luka Modric could leave Real Madrid this off-season. At least that is the option available to Modric. Amid reports, Madrid will allow the 2018 Ballon d'Or winner to decide his future at season's end. While authorities try to deal with racism in football, Bayern Munich has gone further. In launching its Red Against Racism campaign, Bayern is targeting racism in all facets of daily life using all sports in its greater club to spread the word. It is close to our hearts. I believe many clubs feel the same. That's why it is really important that we set an example. Especially nowadays, it's important to act. The initiative by Bayern comes as the Bundesliga tries to curb some ultras from targeting Hoffenheim owner Dietmar Hopp with offensive and threatening banners. From one season to the next, AC Milan is sidetracked by drama and destabilization. The latest episode arrived this week with the sacking of Chief Football Officer Zvonimir Boban after just nine months. It appears Tottenham's injury hit season is on the downslide, but that does not stop Jose Mourinho from keeping his demands high. One player to hear about those demands is midfielder Tangi Ndombele, who felt the manager's public criticism. Tangi had enough time to come to a different level. I think he has to give us more than he's giving us. Bought from Lyon for a club record 60 million euros last summer, the central midfielder has made 27 appearances in all competitions without reaching the level expected. Seemingly always in the market for a striker, Napoli may have found its next target. It has been reported Napoli is considering a summer bid for Real Madrid forward Luka Jovic, who has just two goals in 24 outings this season. Thanks for watching. For all your major news, latest results and in-depth analysis from across the football world, make sure you hit the subscribe button.